Hello, and welcome to Test Complete. In this video, we will show you how to parameterize Test Complete tests. Unlike variables, which are named pieces of data that you use throughout your test, you use parameters to pass data to another test. Recorded tests contain hard-coded values like strings for input text commands. These tests always work in the same manner and input the same data. If you need to run a test with different data, you will have to update the hard-coded values or create a new test. By replacing hard-coded data with test parameters, you can make your test more flexible and easier to maintain and modify. Let's see how it works. This sample test works on an online store website and verifies that the shopping cart shows the correct price for an added product. In our explanation, we will parameterize the searched product name and its price. The test was recorded for the chronograph product. Let's create parameters now. Now, we need to enter the parameter name and type. You can enter some description as well, but we will leave that field empty for now. You can also create parameters from the special parameter page of the test editor. Let's add the second parameter this way. Now, specify the name and type of the second parameter. Let's replace the hard-coded values with parameters. We are replacing this hard-coded string with a query parameter. And replacing this value with the price parameter. The parameters that we created do not have default values, so we cannot run our tests as is because the test engine does not know what values to assign to the parameters. We can run such a parameterized test from another keyword test or script test, or we can run it as a test item. In all cases, you must specify the parameter values before running parameterized tests. Let's see, for example, how to run a test from a keyword test. Create a new test. This test will call our parameterized test. Now let's add the run test operation. Select the test to be run. And now we need to specify the parameter values. Okay, let's run the test now. As you can see, test complete is playing back the test with the appropriate parameters. Now let's find out how to run parameterized tests as test items. Open the test items page of your project. Add your test items to this page and specify parameter values for it. Now we can run the entire project or just one test item. As you can see, Test Complete is playing back the test with the parameters we specified. Okay, now let's see how to parameterize script functions. Our sample project includes a test script that already has parameters. Let's have a look at it. This function searches for a product. Here are the parameters. You specify their values when you call this function from another script function. For instance, this call uses the solar string as a parameter value. The verify product price function checks the price of the selected product. It uses the price parameter that is set in the function call. If needed, you can easily change parameter values. That's it. Now, if we run the test, test complete will use new parameter values. We hope this has helped you understand how to parameterize tests in test complete. Thank you for watching.